Hey everyone, how's it going? Back again with another tutorial. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can get Optifine with shaders on Minecraft 1.17.1. So let's get right into it. Okay, so we're going to want to head to this website here. Optifine.net forward slash downloads. There is a link in the description for this one. And we're going to head here and we're going to go to the Minecraft 1.17.1. Now there's not an official release for this yet. They're still fixing some stuff. So we're just going to want to download the most recent one, which is 3.32. Now just click mirror because it's a faster way. You don't have to go through adverts and click download. And see it's downloaded up there. Now we can head to our downloads folder, which you can just find in Finder, Downloads, and we'll see Optifine 1.17. This one. Okay, now, when we're from here, I'm, on this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to do it with downloading Java on your computer already. Now, if you don't want to download Java, or you haven't got it, there is another video that I have on my YouTube channel uh, where I can show you how to get it without Java. But in this one, it's the easiest method just to download Java. So, if you don't have it already, go head to this website here, and we're going to go down to the macOS installer, find that, click the link here, tick the box, and download. Okay, and once that's downloaded, we'll also find it in the downloads folder here, JDK, etc. Um, we'll double click on that. Just a reminder, if you have Java ready on your computer, you will not need to do this. Double click here. This will come up. Click continue and then install. Now, I already have Java on my computer, so I'm not going to click this. But if you don't, then that's what you need to do. And so once it's installed, it will all do it automatically for you. And we can just do that a bit. So now we have Java installed. Let's make opening this file fine. We just double click, however it will say it cannot be opened because it's from an identified developer. Now we can get around this by just heading to system preferences, or just by clicking that bit there. Security and privacy, general, and you see this bit at the bottom, click open anyway. Open. Now this will come up, telling you don't click anything else here except from install. And there you go, Optifine is successfully installed. Okay, so now we can close everything. Leave that to bin and open Minecraft. And you should see at the bottom 1.17, Optifine, all that. And we just click play, I understand. And here we are, you'll see it says 1.17 mod in the bottom left. That just shows that we are in the right version and we can just head to any world for example and now i'll show you how you can get shaders now on mac not all the shaders work it's a little a little tricky to do but i'll show you the ones that will work on computer and the ones that i would personally use myself okay so if you just see when we're on the shaders wiki it has a whole list of most popular shaders and we can see any of the ones with the apple icon next to them should work on minecraft now not all of them do i found or maybe just on my computer specifically but the ones that i found do work and i quite like are these project luma ones now it does say 1.14 however it still works 1.17 fine so just head to this website here and you just download the most recent file which is this one and that's downloaded okay so now we go to our downloads folder and you should see the shaders here just drag them onto the desktop to make it a bit easier Enter on. and now when we're in minecraft in our 1.17.1 optifine world click on options video settings shaders 
and group shaders folder. Now this folder will come up here and all you've got to do is just drag the shaders into this folder now. Yeah. As you see I've already got it. Yeah, That's basically it. And now when you head back to your shaders you'll see that it says Project Luma plus minus plus version 1 or whatever shader version you're using. Click on that. And there we go. Now, you may find little frame rate issues depending on the quality of your computer, but there are settings that you can change to tone down how, how much the shaders are doing. So, yeah. And there you go. That is the tutorial on how to get shaders in Minecraft 1.17. I hope you did all enjoy this video, and if you did find it useful, Please feel free to like and if it was really good maybe subscribe you know help help your boy out it's like thank you for watching and see you next time bye